One of the joys of living in 2008 is the chance to become an overnight star thanks to websites like YouTube. One of YouTube's biggest stars is a Korean man known as Fun2, whose guitar solo three years ago made him an internet sensation. How big? Well, his video has well over 49 million views and counting. It's the top favorited music video of all time. David Farrier went in search of Fun2 and found him not in Korea, but Auckland. This is the video that set the internet a buzz. A mysterious character playing his guitar with such gusto had captured the imagination of viewers all over the planet. More than 200,000 comments later, YouTube viewers are still discussing it, much to the amusement of 24-year-old Jay Lim. Who I found at Auckland University. I'm currently studying computer science and information system, and I'm on second year. Jay took last year off to see the world, finding time to busk in places like Prague and Mexico. Of course, he filmed it, and it went straight on YouTube. But strangely enough, Jay has never played publicly here, so he set a date, deciding to meet at Mission Bay. Years ago, about the same time he shifted to New Zealand, Jay didn't even know what a guitar was. That all changed when he heard a small grunge band who hailed from Seattle. The first motivation was in Nirvana. I first heard the, um, the song called Smells Like Teen, Sp Teen Spirit. The first, very first guitar riff was so impressive for me. I thought like, oh, what's the, what's the name of the instrument it sounds like this? So that's the first motivation. So you hadn't even heard of a guitar before that song? Uh, no, no, I've never heard about like um, some, some rock music. But when I, was, when I was really young, like this tall, but I once heard Metallica. <laughs> but I, I, can't, I cannot imagine that I, I would play the guitar in future. Jay began taking guitar lessons, but found it too boring, instead opting to teach himself. After making sure his face was hidden by a hat, he posted some videos on a Korean music site under the name Fun2, so he could get some feedback on his progress. It was someone else called Guitar90 who grabbed the video and put it on YouTube, where it became a sensation. That five minute video has become one of the site's most popular ever. But he didn't stay hidden for long. A year into the sensation, another YouTube user decided to pose as fun too. Jay decided it was time to come out of the YouTube closet and quickly found himself all over Korean TV. As well as CNN, NBC, CBC and KBS. Was that a bit weird or was that okay? It was totally a yeah, rare experience as well as it's so unfamiliar because um, I never imagined that I, I could be uh, some kind of stars or a famous, famous, famous person. Some of my friends in New Zealand, they actually know the truth, but... Um, and what, what do they think? They... <laughs> I, uh, they think, like, hmm, how, how can you be a uh, kind of stars? Because um, they said, like, you are not even handsome or <laughs> something like that. <laughs> but just when he thinks the buzz is winding down, something else happens. Like in April, when American band Weezer released their new song, Pork and Beans, which topped Billboard's modern rock chart for 11 straight weeks. 
Have you seen the Weezer music video? Yeah, pork and bean. The video opens with a familiar looking room. They say I need some roguing to put in my hair. Actually, the in intro scene was um, exactly like my video. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's some, some dark, dark bedroom and the uh, backlight from the back window. Yeah, that aspects are all exactly the same as my video. So I, I noticed that um, they. Um, <laughs> how, how, how can it? How can you say that? It's parody something? Yeah, parody. Ah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that must have been pretty cool because Weezer are a really big band. I know. Yeah, I, I am a big fan of Weezer as well. Yeah. With that said, he has no big plans for forming his own band here in New Zealand, preferring to knuckle down and finish his degree, avoiding any potential distractions. Jay Lim, it seems, is a curiosity, a celebrity who's not seeking celebrity. Okay.